together are now what meteorologist Job is starting. We're going to put oxy uh, oxygen. We're going to put CO2 in its place here. All right? We're going to take a look at what the atmosphere has totally. 78% of the atmosphere is nitrogen. 21% of the atmosphere is oxygen. The rest of the 1% is occupied primarily by argon. Now, if we look over here, right, we need a close-up of that, right? So let's see what that says. Nature-made CO2 is three-quarters of the CO2. Man-made CO2 is one-quarter of the CO2. This, <laughs> this amount, this is 1% of 1%, which is extremely tiny, right? And so let's say we doubled it, okay? It'd be 2% of 1%. But, but the vast majority of the atmosphere, as you can see, is run by nitrogen and oxygen, and the water vapor of the atmosphere is the number one greenhouse gas. So this is going to be the shortest weather or not ever. I just want to show you these charts, and I want you to think about this, right? There's nature-made CO2. There's man-made CO2. And here is the rest of the picture, okay? So... If you're thinking that this is somehow or the other going to push around this, especially given its radiative properties, its feedback properties, it op op operates, speak, Joe, in a very small range, all right, and it, very cold temperatures. Uh, hey, <laughs> I, I, I don't know, all right, but I think you should be, you should be respective of the perspective, all right? When you look at the big picture over here, you can see exactly how small man's contribution is. Okay? All right, good. That's it for now. Enjoy the weather. It's the only weather you've got.